bush evergreen found a really nice one a rugged classic that has been given a second life oh man check out that uh, that trunk right there we got to try to pull in here real quick hey sweet pickup man thank you it's like a baja style there huh Let's check that truck out. Yeah, I'd love it. So, it's a 1969 K20, uh -huh. and this truck was beat up. It lived a really hard life before I got a hold of it. It was a escort and setup truck for a mobile home uh, delivery service. Five years ago, Mark Podine started with $2,200 to buy it and a big dream to recreate the truck he used to own back in high school. And this big, bad red beast is the result. I kind of wanted a truck that had really good street manners. Um, I wanted it to be capable off-road, and I didn't want it to be a one-trick pony. There's rugged, tough components all throughout this truck, from top to bottom. The wheels and tires, suspension components, and drivetrain are all upgraded and extremely capable. But there is some beauty with this beast. The interior is modern and comfortable. It even has AC. <laughs> The truck was originally built with a 350. I upgraded to a 383 stroker. With about 440 horsepower, Mark says it's easy to get behind the wheel and forget about the $32,000 he spent building this truck. Shifting gears and getting these big tires rolling takes him right back to being 20 years old. And you can't put a price tag on that. On the auto ambush, Eric Green, KOAT Action 7 News. If you want a truck like that, Mark says you're going to have to be prepared to dig deep. They are really popular right now, and similar trucks to this have sold at auction for fifty-five to $60,000. Dollars. Great well, color, too. It's a nice shade of red. Yeah, he kind of back to the way he wanted his truck to be back in high school. That's yeah. pretty cool to do that. I very, mean, it costs cool. some money, but you have to love what you do and look at the results. Worth it, wow. yes. Well, more